everyone, this is Tom here from the Blue Root team. I'm here to show you how you can actually update the stages in your, the deals of your Zoho CRM account. So if, if you've just installed Zoho CRM, you probably see some stages like qualification, needs analysis, these types of things. But let's say you want to make it very specific to your particular business, which I would definitely recommend. Here's how you can do that. What you're going to want to do is go to the settings area and you can do that by clicking this wrench and screwdriver in the top right corner. So I click in this, this is kind of the settings area here and you can see that there's nine ish areas. And the one I want to focus on is the customization. So within customization, I'm going to click modules and fields. And what's going to pop up is a bunch of your modules. And since we're looking at the deal modules and the stages and the deals, let's click that. So we're going to click that. And then you might have different layouts, but if it's you're new to Zoho, they'll just be the standard one. You just want to, going to want to hit standard. And so it comes this editor here and this editor can do a lot of things. And I've covered this in other videos on how to customize your Zoho CRM. But to be specific about stages, what you're going to want to do is go to the stage field here. And then you're going to hit these three dots here. So let's do that. What's going to pop up is a bunch of different options here and it's not going to be obvious right away. The one you're going to want to hit is stage probability mapping. So let's hit that. Then what's going to pop up is all of your stages. So this is where we wanted to get to. And so in here you can do a couple things. You can remove certain stages. So value prop I don't use and you know, you can add new stages. So maybe you could say, you know, deal oh, caps locks on deal qualified by manager maybe there's an extra stage in there and you can add it in you can the next part here is your probability um, it really depends on your organization if you're going to use it um, but really this allows you to Zoho to maybe predict your expected revenue that's the idea of this probability here some organizations use it some don't it's up to you the next one's here. So forecast type. This is if the, based on this stage, is the deal open? Is it one or is it lost? And for this one, we're going to say it's probably open. A lot of them you can see are open. And then the forecast category is, is this currently in the pipeline? Is it closed or omitted? So once again, it's probably in the pipeline. So you can see a lot of them do the open pipeline. The ones that wouldn't be are down here. You know, closed one is considered closed, closed, lost, omitted, closed, lost, omitted. And you can see the ones closed one, closed, lost close loss to competition. So now that that's created, that's perfect. I'll just hit done. I can hit save up here. It says, great, this has been successfully updated. And then if I quickly jump over to deals here, let's create a new deal. If I look at my stages now, now I have this new stage that's available to me. Let's quickly just put in a deal name, Tom's deal here, the account, and just create a new account, Tom's account. We'll hit save again and save. And so now you can see all these stages here and here's that new one that I had and that value prop one no longer exists. And so that's how you can add those stages. Thanks for watching guys. Please in the comments, leave any comments on what videos you would like to see next so we can continue to create valuable content for you guys. Thanks. Thanks for watching this video. Please be sure to subscribe to the channel and leave any comments in the section below.